Clancy of the Overflow by Banjo Patterson. I sent Clancy a text the other day. Yeah, feeling bored. This is a bloke I met at Lachlan ages ago. He was a shearer, so I thought, what the hell, why not? Nothing fussy, just a quick text. G'day Clancy mate, how's the overflow? Bugger me, he texts me back quick as a flash. It came up on Facebook, then Twitter. I'm thinking, WTF? Then I realised it was some mate of his rambling on, not him. Clancy took off to Queensland riding a horse of all things. I started thinking about Clancy. He was a crazy guy, but funny. This guy reckons he took off to Cooper with a bunch of cowboys. I can see Clancy trotting behind a herd of cattle laughing and singing. He'd be lapping it up as only he knew how. Making new friends, which includes horses, of course. Uh, he'd be half hanging on through the wind and the river crossings. He'd be seeing some bloody good scenery out there. And man, those stars out there are friggin' like lanterns in the sky. So here I am, stuck in this shitty little office, bugger all sunlight, with a stuffy air conditioner, with crappy city dust getting in, and mate, the smell coming through the window, totally pong. And all I can hear outside are noisy ding ding trams, buses nearly running over people that are everywhere, kids are out there screaming and carrying on, people shuffling like herds up and down the street. People rushing here and there with shitty faces. Everyone bumping into each other, pu pushing past each other. Unhappy, shitty people rushing who knows where. They're like ants, all in a rush. No time for anything. I think when I see all this I need a change. Maybe I need a horse and to just ride off to Queensland. So I sit here staring at my notebook computer. Maybe a horse would bite me. Nah, bad idea. <laughs>